Hey Collective, welcome back. This is Vita with another general message. Take what resonates, kick rocks to the rest. Judication, first card out. Number 30, something to do with court judgment, a false person, and possibly imprisonment. Let's get a couple more cards. False person, judication. 38 breaks down to an 11. You could be seeing 11, 11, 1, 1, 1, often thoughts. Number 16, pathway. Someone regrets the pathway that they chose. They're thinking a lot about you. You could be thinking a lot about someone. This person could be in your good graces or they could be someone that you're finding out is false. Child is in reverse. This energy came out yesterday. Concern. There's a masculine energy that is realizing a feminine is false. Although here the masculine has the mask off. This energy, there's no mask. We do have child that's in the reverse. Concern. There's concern about a child. There's concern about perhaps a woman that's expecting a child that they are not in a marriage with. This person could already be in a marriage. There's some sort of court situation involving a child. No new beginning. One more card. Okay, distant horizons, sideways, and despair. Family room. So this is about a family dynamic, a breakup of a family. There's a lot of heartache, despair, confusion, not sure about the future. Why is judication here? Pleasure seekers, it's in the reverse. And then we have consolation. So someone, <clears throat> this could have been a one night stand. Even someone is in a lot of regret that they uh, went with their, went toward a temptation, something tempting. Pleasure seekers in reverse underneath judication. There is some truths that are coming out. People are no longer gaining pleasure in um, things that really don't matter. The things that don't matter are causing harm to the things that do matter. Family, children. There's room here that's empty. And then we've got conversation. Someone wants to have a conversation. Frivolity is in the upright. So a lot of ego energy People feeling themselves too much, thinking that they're not going to get caught. They're not going to have to suffer repercussions for their ill manners and deeds. Messenger, there's a message that's coming in. Fortune, something about your money is increasing. Why is false person here? Someone's receiving a windfall. False person. Yeah, with all this red, this was some sort of fiery, um, forbidden type one night stand or maybe a very short lived affair. False person. <laughs> Look at that. Lord, it's in the reverse. Clarifying false person and then money. Oh, someone pretended to not care about money. Someone tried to get, oh, someone tried to get someone's money through a scheme, some sort of child scheme. It feels like soldier. Let's get another card for Lord in reverse. Whoa. Reunion, and it landed sideways on distant horizon. So someone, oh, and then we've got thief. Huh. This is interesting. Thief, messenger. Let's get some more cards before I read too much into this just yet. Lord is in the reverse. 
reunion sideways, clarified distant horizon, and it's the opposite direction. Reunion's going this way, distant horizons is going that way. So something is up in the air regarding um, making amends with someone else or some sort of contract, contractual obligation, thoughts. And now we've got doctor, it's sideways. And then we've got sweetheart here. You're the sweetheart. Someone is finding out some news about their health. Someone wants you to be in bad health. Hmm. Child in reverse. Yep. Young woman. What did I tell y'all? This energy came out yesterday and I didn't I didn't uh post the cards that had come out, look, sweetheart, death. Huh. There's a young woman, child is in the reverse. There's a young woman that tried to snag a masculine energy through some sort of quickie one night stand, said they were pregnant. Maybe they were, maybe they are, but... This child is in the reverse. And then we've got death and sweetheart letter. Hmm. Let's keep going. Why is despair here? Merchant despair. This really feels like a business. Someone has had to pack up their business. They're losing everything because of this dynamic that they, uh, I just heard the word impetuous, and I don't really know how to apply that here. Impetuous. Hmm, I don't know. Sighs, sighing, thoughts. In, okay, and thoughts is already here. Someone's thinking a lot about you, how they messed, how could they have messed this up? Something's messed up. Something's out of order. Pleasure seekers in the... He knows you are a liar, resents being played for a fool. Be careful. So whatever this is, whatever masculine this is, how this might relate to your energy, if this is you, someone's very upset. They know they've been lied to and they want to make whoever the liar is regret the day that they tried to get over on this person with this scam, this pregnancy scam. This is a scam. This is, yeah. Let's get the tarot before I use those cards. Pleasure seekers in the reverse. Actually, I always do this. I don't know why. Pleasure seekers in the reverse. Oh my goodness. Judication. Pleasure seekers in the reverse. Money some money, marriage. I'm telling you, this is like some, ooh, enemy. So now there's a marriage that's breaking up because of this. This is a hot ass mess, man. Has to do with some money. Someone's not getting some money. Someone thought they were getting some money. Maybe this young woman thought she was going to get money up front to assist with her pregnancy, something like that. Like even a surrogate, maybe. No, could be a surrogate mother scam. Lord in reverse. Mm. Someone tried to be present themselves as holier than thou, and it didn't go over too well. Hope. Someone's got a lot of hope that this is going to turn around, but there's death here. Unexpected joy. Ooh, goodness. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. See this unexpected joy, even though this is money here. You hear this this phrase a lot with when it comes to maybe an unexpected pregnancy, unexpected joy, you know, children being a joy, unexpected with this current scenario here, the false person, the young woman with the child in reverse, 
and the Lord in reverse. And then we've got hope in the upright, death, unexpected joy, official person. So some this uh, it feels like a karmic feminine energy realizes that her time is up. This isn't working. She she's she's not gonna get anywhere, get any money. However, the person, the energy that they were trying to entrap is losing a lot. A lot. Jealousy. Someone's very jealous, merriment of how happy you are. I don't know how the collective is fitting into this dynamic exactly, but it's close to you some kind of way if you're resonating. Jealousy. Someone's jealous of your good health. Why is doctor here sideways? That's a lot of cards. Look at that. Unexpected joy in the reverse landed on this young woman and this child in reverse. Loss. There's a loss here, a major loss. It could be money. It could be maybe there was like a uh, accident or something like that. I'm not going to. There's certain things I don't like to speak on in my readings. I know this is for entertainment purposes only, but I, I don't play around when it comes to certain things coming out of my mouth. I really don't, especially as a mother. So you guys can read into that, how it's showing up. Fortune and officer loss. This was some sort of ba baby scam set up and it went haywire. All right, that landed over there. Unexpected joy in reverse. I was using a clarified doctor sideways. It landed with the young woman and the child. So this could be This could be some sort of cons consoling, like see the doctor's holding this feminine's hand here, her, her wrist, holding her wrist, there's sorrow, there's loss, thoughts. Someone's thinking of you as this plays out in their life. Merriment, they see happiness in their future now that something is turning around for them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's try this again, doctor. Love, and it's in the reverse, and it landed once again with this young woman, child in reverse, unexpected joy. There was no love here. No love here. Falseness. Whatever relationship this was, it was fake very fake <clears throat> reunion sideways no love lost no love to be gained this is a nightmare for someone reunion landing on love anger anger has replaced love here death someone wants someone to just get kicked out of off this planet this is some real gritty energy someone is very upset feels like a masculine energy they know they've been played they've been bamboozled suckered sucker punched someone tried to get their money this young woman could have been working with another masculine energy why is merchant here and with this despair and merchant this could be having to flee having to leave because this is too much Merchant. Mm -mm -mm. Sweetheart, and it's sideways, lost again. Someone feels like they've lost you for good because of their constant um, <coughs> movie role of drama. Whoever this is, this person loves drama until something backfires and then they're all like in 
Like, oh my God, Judge is at the bottom. Let's get some more intel here. Some money. Why is some money here? He wants you to stay fat so no other men will be attracted to you. Some money, pleasure seekers in the reverse, adjudication. So this is someone connected to you. They know that you're out of reach and so they want you to become very grotesque, not attractive to any other suitors. They don't want you to have any money. They don't want you to have a future. They could feel energetically that there is Something marvelous coming your way. They're upset about it. They want you to gain a lot of weight. Have some bad health. They might even want to offer you some money. Why is hope here? He believes he can't live without you, girl. You better run. Yeah, this is a masculine energy that got caught off. Oh, why do you treat me so cold? They couldn't need your shoulder to cry on, this person. They got no one to talk to, and they're embarrassed by whatever this is. They're very embarrassed. This young woman could be very young. Like, this could be an older, mature-ish looking, masculine got involved with a young woman, something like that, and now they are very angry. Hmm. Why is love here in the reverse? Your children love you more than you know. Now that's a very interesting contrast to love being in the reverse. Mind games failed. Someone could have literally have tried to convince your children that you were a destructive being, selfish, that you didn't love your children or something like that. This Someone tried to get to someone's child and uh, turn them against them and it didn't work because your children love you very much. So this could even be even though the marriage card isn't out, this could be separate from this pregnancy scam. There's a marriage here that's breaking up. You've got one parent trying to demonize another parent because of this mistake or whatever this is. But the children, no matter what the parent is saying about the other parent, the children still have love for both, perhaps. But there's anger here. So why is anger here? Someone's angry that your children love you if you're a parent. They're jealous. A lot of karmic, karmic lower vibrational energy in this. In this. No king is saved by the size of his army. No warrior escapes by his great strength. Psalm 33-16, it's in the reverse, clarifying anger. I am forever altered by your energetic authority, and I am grateful to God for your gifts. We've got the Lord in the reverse. So this feels like someone connected to you who's angry that they are in this situation. They, they're blaming you partly. They feel like if they would have stayed with you or you would have stuck it out with them, they wouldn't be going through this turmoil. And so there's anger there against the perpetrators of whatever this is and toward you. They feel like your energy could have stopped this from happening. Someone sees you as their savior. Unexpected income in the reverse. Corrupt local politician could involve Oh, look, Hancock twin flame in reverse. So this is a twin flame, could be a twin flame in reverse energy. A corrupt local politician is involved, could be involved. Unexpected income, unexpected joy, I'm sorry, in the reverse. You could be receiving unexpected income. 
hostile spiritual takeover is what clarified that. Their names could be Susan, Thomas, Alistair, Maven, Henry, Tori, or Troy. Hostile spiritual takeover. Someone tried to take over your divine spirit, your gifts, your essence. You could be having a lot of very illicit type dreams. Maybe dreams where you're not wearing clothing. You're doing a, there's a lot of thought, a lot of telekinetic energy in your dream state. Whatever God wants you to see, you will be shown. You're being shown a lot of uh, demolition that's going on in individual lives and it's trickling outward into the collective as a whole. So you could be feeling some really um, rickety. Is that even a word, rickety? Like I just pictured a wagon where the wooden, like a very old wagon where the wooden wheels are like clanking all four. Like they can't really pick up speed. Someone can't pick up speed, gain momentum. There's no forward movement in this person's life. Ugh. He, he was a serial killer in a past life. This could be a past life energy, past life soulmate connection. Someone tried to take over your gifts in the astrals. They failed miserably. Reunion in the reverse. Once again, we're seeing this card. Pay attention to the news. I'm not going to get too much into the meaning here, but um, yeah. Pay attention. You will see them again, and when you do, you will be happy. Virgo Taurus, it's clarifying reunion in the reverse. So there's someone here that feels they will see you again, and when they do, they'll be quite happy. You could be feeling this way about this person. There's someone that you could be thinking a lot about that you want to reunite with or vice versa. Or not at all. If it doesn't apply, it doesn't apply. Sweetheart in the reverse. So we got sweetheart in the reverse, reunion in the reverse. Doctor in the reverse. Someone wants to heal a connection with you. They regret trying to distort your energy. There's copycat energy here as well. Sweetheart. Morally bankrupt. I, this card just caught my attention. And then behind that, we've got maggot brain so there is definitely the energy of someone that just can't get their thoughts proper and right karmic femme feels used and abused depleted she brought a lie and stole the truth is clarifying sweetheart sideways on the run is landed on size so this is a karmic feminine energy that paid someone to try to do something to you. Hostile spiritual demolition. Try to demolish your gifts, your aura, your divine light. Couldn't do it. Failed miserably under judgment. Feels like a couple spouse addicted to heroin and meth. So there's some addiction here. Ah, let's go to the tarot. <clears throat> he wants you to stay fat. So no other men will be attracted to you. You could be looking very glowy and dewy, and this person could be spying on you and seeing you do your thing and just doesn't want anyone looking your way. You could be very single. Page of Pentacles. Good news. Offer coming in. Knight of Wands. Six of Cups. Two of Cups. Two of Pentacles. <coughs> yep. Knight of Wands with the Six of Cups. Clarifying. He wants you to stay fat with the Two of Cups and the Two of Pentacles. This person definitely does not want you moving forward in a relationship with someone else. And they do sense that something is coming to you. 
world, they know that it's over with you and no matter what they offer you, the page of pentacles and then we have some money here. So this person knows you're getting some money. Judgment. Things are changing for you. That will be quite beneficial. Seven of Wands just kind of flipped out. Queen of Pentacles. Five of Cups. There's regret. There was deception. And there's a lot of regret. Why is he believes he can't live without you? Nine of Swords. Justice. We've already got adjudication. So there's someone that could really be going to jail and they can't bear the thought. They're losing their freedom. They really messed things up. Still hoping, there's still hope here. Nine of Swords. Hmm. Better run, better run, on the run. Someone better run. Doctor Sideways. Magician. Seven of Swords. Knight of Swords. High Priestess and the Tower. It's a very interesting combination to come out. Clarifying. Doctor. And I do believe I said that uh, there was someone that paid a practitioner, I might not have used the word practitioner, but with this hostile spiritual takeover, the magician and the seven of swords here, someone paid someone to perhaps cause you harm. This could be poison, poisoning your food, your drink, crashing into your car. We've got this king of sword, knight of swords here high priestess tower trying to slip a tower in on you but you're able to see things and spirit moves you accordingly someone can't keep up with your schedule you might not have a set schedule you're definitely manifesting you've got a couple of thieves in your energy they're angry doctor clarifying doctor that's sideways Anything that was sent to you has been sent back. Hmm. I'm gonna leave that out just like that for now and see if anything else comes to me. Magician, Seven of Swords. Knight of Swords. Moving fast. Whatever God wants you to see, you will be shown. So you're being shown this deception, this plot. Someone who was getting uh, scammed on, they see clearly what's happened. Why is this tower here? Let's get another deck. Tower. <clears throat> Excuse me. Tower. A lot of different storylines coming through this reading for sure magician tower we've already got magician with the seven of swords and now we've got knight of swords what in the hell is going on with this i don't like this five of swords i don't like this two of swords someone's paid someone to cause someone harm and they're waiting they're waiting to see the results. Tower Magician. <sighs> High Priestess. This is your energy as well. This is your energy. High Priestess, Magician, Tower, Magician twice. Two of Cups. Clarifying High Priestess. Ten of Pentacles. Your children love you very much. Ten of Pentacles. Eight of Cups in the reverse. Star in the upright. Nine of Swords. 
King of Wands, Seven of Pentacles. There's someone coming towards you that wants to invest with you. They see beyond just your potential. They know that you're powerful, that you're making moves. This feels very otherworldly, astral, cosmic. This is not of this realm energy. There's just too much lightning, lightning speed. Whatever was being plotted against you was stopped in the ass in the in the in another realm. Strategy. Seven of Swords in this magician. This is strategy. Strategy against an enemy being resourceful, more resourceful than anyone could have imagined. You're more resourceful than anyone could have imagined. Just when they think a tower is gonna take you out, you bounce back. And this creates another nightmare for this person or these people. <sighs> Knight of Swords. The Moon. Clarifying Knight of Swords and Strength. Four of Swords. Destiny. Doctor in the reverse. Don't forget that's there. So this is about someone's ill health. They think you don't know, but you know, and they want to come toward you. They need your healing. You're their last hope. Like I said earlier, you're someone's savior. They see you as a savior. High Priestess, the Moon, Knight of Swords, Seven of Swords, something, King of Wands, clarifying Seven of Swords, Five of Cups. So there's a King of Wands and a lot of regret, fire, energy. Still strategizing, still in hiding, keeping secrets, being found out. Secrets are being found out, illuminated. Magician, <laughs> the tower. This is bananas. Art priestess again. What the hell? Okay. I have got to kind of get some clarity here because the same cards keep coming out. And I feel like I'm missing something, but I'm not. Because we've got anger underneath. We've got love in reverse. Magician twice. Art priestess twice. The moon. Tower two times. This is very dark energy. This is not good. Let me go back to this deck. Tower. Let's clarify. Let's clarify tower. I'm getting upset. Someone's very upset that this plan didn't work. Someone's trying to take someone out, man. <sighs> Under investigation for drug smuggling. Look smart, but stupid is the tower. Someone tried to outsmart the law. They couldn't because they're stupid. Someone could have tried to use some sort of legal maneuver to outsmart a judge, a sentence. The divine thought they were a god. Mm. Okay. Let's clarify this tower. They can do what they want with your life, but they cannot do what they want with yours. I knew it. This is the energy of someone wanting to knock you out of here and spirit came through, coming through. There's a blanket of protection over you. There's a blanket of protection over someone. There is a plot here to stop your new beginning. This, this reading has gone completely like on some sort of Axel-like Started off with this masculine and this false young woman baby situation. And now it's kind of come all the way back to you and a plot against you. And or this could be a plot against this young woman. But it feels more like you with the sweetheart coming out sideways and the reunion coming out sideways. And we did see the Hancock Twin Flame card in the reverse. It's 
get some final messages because I'm worn out from this. Actually, let's get a card for King of Wands. King of Wands. Two cards. They want to sabotage your sobriety. Don't let them in. Clarifying King of Wands. Whatever God wants you to see, you will be shown. So you're being shown just how uh, malicious this person is. Just how much they this, they want to hurt you. You're being shown that now. Maybe God wasn't showing you that all the way because it wasn't time. But if you ever had any doubt about who this person is and how they really feel about you, it's kind of showing up now in this card, in these cards. This person, they hate who you are. They hate who you are. They hate who they couldn't become. And they don't want to see you have anything. Final messages. She lied on you to keep this man away. I can't stop myself from watching you. So there's a couple of people that are still watching you. Lies are still being told about you. I don't feel like you really care, Collective. You want this uh, cycle to exit out of your reality if it's in your reality or if it's just something that you feel. Just let it ride. It's going to, 2024 is going to be a lot different. I really feel that. So keep doing your work, developing your skills, working on your businesses, your creativity. If you're, if you're a writer, you know, self-publish. There's tons of avenues online where you don't need an actual publisher. You can do that yourself. Start a blog yada yada all right and i'll see you guys in another video